by Aquarius. So, thank you guys for tuning into my channel. Please keep in mind that my readings are general and may or may not resonate. So, take the rest and leave the rest. Also, please be sure to check your sun, moon, rising, and Venus sign for more insight. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you guys would like to book a personal with me, ask me a question, or just check out my horoscope page, everything that you need will be down in the comment section listed below. If you guys would like to book a personal with me, ask me a question, or just... Oh, I already said that, right? <laughs> All right. Yep. Some of you guys may be repeating yourself. You may feel like you have to keep repeating yourself. I keep hearing that song by uh, Queen Naja. Pack light. I don't even know that song. Don't even like it, but I keep hearing that song, so maybe that's something you need to listen to. Okay, two of cups. So there's a really strong connection to somebody that you have. Could be a water, cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. But there are some secrets that you found out about. Four of cups, you feel a sense of rejection, or maybe this person does. Yeah, I feel like you turned your back on something that made you very happy because this person was juggling you you might have found out that this person was a fucking clown okay so four of cups and the sun yeah this person is sad too because they did want a relationship with you but with the uh strength card i feel like they're holding back now because maybe you are too yeah it was unbalanced anyway this person was very manipulating and you almost felt a, a sense of being stuck but you know the truth about the situation so you're sad but you know what it is now maybe before you were questioning what was going on and you got some clarity on it this person was happy with you but i feel like it was for all the wrong reasons it was because of what they can give could get from you what your potential was and with the magician card this person is extremely manipulating and they kept you stuck in your head while they were still fucking around with other people two of pentacles ten of cups they already had a whole relationship somebody that they were already in love with but first i don't know how the fuck this person had you and this person because they have a strong connection with you too maybe you you and this person that they were dealing with were both soulmates for this person okay or maybe this was a karmic for you and that's why the connection was so strong this was something that you had to learn Okay, so let's look a little deeper. Let's see how this person is viewing you, what they want to say to you, how they're feeling. Six of Cups, so they're thinking about you a lot. This person has a problem. They're thinking about you and they're trying to figure out how to... Uh, fix this situation but the two of pentacles is kind of like they're they're indecisive on if it's even worth it anymore because again they're looking at it from the tangible gains they're like if i come back and i apologize she still or he still is not going to be giving me what i want anymore because the jig is up yeah this person is going to wait i feel like they're going to pull their energy back for a minute and wait to see you know what move they should take next with you that maybe they're giving you a minute to calm down yeah, they're definitely going to be holding back right now. It definitely could be a Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, but this person is going to come in and try to offer some type of emotions again. But again, it's for the tangible reasons. This person is looking at you like a big lick, okay? Excuse me. For you who don't know what lick is, that's somebody who, you know, a, a come up. Like, this person is looking at you for the tangible reasons, the things that you could give. But there is a sense of emotions here, too. Let's see. Six of Cups, Page of Pentacles. What is this? Yeah, they know that you have your guard up. And even if they do come back, you may still end it. So I feel like they're going to decide to just stay to themselves. You guys aren't even speaking right now. Um, for a Pentacle, I mean, Page of Pentacles, this person is very immature. They don't even have that much fucking money. I feel like this person is, might be like... I don't want to say beneath you, but they don't have what you have. And and so you may cover up all those spots that's missing for them. And that's not your fucking job. Okay? Again, mothering energy. You guys are very nurturing, but I feel like somebody here is willing and ready to take advantage of that. Okay, so let's get an outcome. Spirit, please give me an outcome for Aquarius. Outcome, please, for Aquarius, please. Outcome for Aquarius. The Queen of Wands, Nine of Pentacles, be okay with yourself. 
<laughs> all right i see you guys getting your power back getting sexy back you know doing your own thing and this person rushing into you again but, but i also see you holding back because maybe you already feel like okay this is not worth investing and i don't feel like it is because just as quick as this motherfucker running they'll leave back out too okay spirit give me some advice advice for aquarius i swear i keep hearing pack like Mm. all right spirit please give me um advice all right so there there is a need for you to reject somebody uh king of wands it could be an aries leo or sagittarius or somebody who's very promiscuous and has a lot of passion um when this person comes back to show you some type of attention, I would just keep moving forward because spirit is telling you that you already know what you need to know about this person. This person is uh, a whore, okay? I'm sorry, but that's what it is. This person has a lot of passion for everybody. Like, they use sex as manipulation and they, they might have, you know, had you a little open because of it. All right, so let's get one card from the Rebel deck. It says... Ta-da! Figure that shit out on your own. One more. It says, get over yourself. Pull your shit together. Help people give back. Do some good shit for humanity. All right. Have a good one.